In the summertime, it's so nice to have a good repertoire of recipes that are quick to make and you don't have to heat up the kitchen to enjoy them. Today I'm going to show you how to make a snow pea salad. Snow peas are these flat little peas that you can get in the produce department. They're often used in stir fries, but you can eat them raw. They don't have to be cooked. They're really nice and crunchy and light. And so I'm going to use these snow peas, put them in a bowl with a light vinaigrette, and it's ready to go so you don't have to heat the kitchen. It's really quick. I'm gonna start by putting some sesame oil in my bowl. And sesame oil that I'm using today is the light sesame oil. It's not the toasted. That is really, really strong. And I just want a nice light flavor in my dressing. I'm going to add two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar and a couple of teaspoons of honey, nice local honey. That will sweeten this up just a little bit. And then I'm going to put in my snow peas. Now, typically, the snow peas will be, you know, pretty good size to just put in whole, but I had some large ones, so some of them I cut in half, and you can easily do that. And, you know, before I do that, I'm just going to whisk this up a, just a tiny bit just to get that honey dissolved in the oil and the vinegar. And then I'm going to put my snow peas into the bowl. And I'm going to add some sesame seeds. So you can tell this has a little bit of an Asian flair to it. I've got a quarter cup of sesame seeds. And this salad is nice because it's so full of fiber and vitamins and it's light and crunchy. Green onions, probably one bunch of green onions I sliced up on the diagonal. So I'm just going to mix it up because I want all of the snow peas to be coated with that light vinaigrette. I'm going to season it with a little bit of sea salt and a little bit of white pepper. I really like white pepper in this recipe because it's got a really strong kind of a biting flavor to it. And at this point, I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator and let it chill for a while. You can serve this salad chilled, you can serve it at room temperature, but the best part, it will keep in the refrigerator for a week and it'll taste fabulous. A lot of times at serving, I like to sprinkle some toasted sliced almonds over the top. It's a great addition. So give this salad a try. It's simple, it's quick, and you don't have to heat up your kitchen. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.